I've got to admit, I tried really hard to make that, that little intro clip something special, but oh, there's too many mods. My computer could not handle running replay mod for that long. So, we built a house. It's a beautiful little thing. It's my first little... I was going for a cottage style, and... <clears throat> man, I tried to... I, I, re I really tried to get this thing built yesterday. And it took all freaking day to collect the, the materials. Very basic materials, too. But I think it turned out really cute, actually. I'm, I'm quite satisfied with this. Look at this. It even says winter on the doormat. So people get to walk all over me when they come into my house. <laughs> uh, we got a beautiful little kitchen with all the stuff. Um, a little table to sit at. I tried doing this thing where I picked where the windows would go based on how I did the interior. So, I really strongly thought about putting a window in right here, but ultimately decided against it. But like this window's here because that's how I wanted to do the kitchen. Like that window's there, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. All because of how I did the interior. Now I got my bedroom upstairs. We can do a little bit of extra storage up top. This little house turned out so cute, so perfect. Lots of storage downstairs for housing all of her stuff, but I chose this area, this really strange area that we that we've been calling the sad lands. Like, look look at this place. There's nothing in the water. Like, it's just it's just bare in there. And if we find us, there's a little ravine out this way. And if we go look in the ravine, we'll notice that there's there's nothing in it. Like that cave. There's nothing in it. See, look. There's no ores. There's no nothing. There's nothing. <laughs> It's absolutely bare. Sadly, just a weird place that generated that didn't have any uh, any stuff in it. Now, I picked this location, not only because Kafers is close by, actually I picked it before Kafers showed up, but it's cool that she's here, uh, because I thought this this would make some like some really nice uh, farmland, uh, and that's going to be really important uh, in this particular mod pack, obviously, it's, uh, it's the Pam's Harvest Craft, so obviously we're going to be doing lots of farming, so we got to do lots of terraforming today. And, and, the camera mod. I gotta show you something. All right, you ready to check this out? Look at this. We're gonna open this, I'm gonna click upload, and then this part you guys can't see, but I'm selecting an image, I'm gonna push open. And then we should have, there it is. Ready? You're gonna pause the screen, well, you can pause it here in a moment. We have our first newspaper. Ready? I'll put it in here. There, ready, I'm gonna do this. Pause it if you want to read it, otherwise I'm just going to gloss over this real quick. Alright, here we go. So this is our first newspaper, and it's all about the first day, and, uh, you know, the stuff going on. But, there is something funny about the Chocobos. This version of Choco Craft 4, unfortunately, I did a ton of testing in a single player world, and not only can these guys not get any of the special abilities that their UI says that they should be able to get, but they also cannot breed different colors. Just flat out doesn't work in this version. It's only these yellow chocobos and maybe the fire ones. I think it's the fire ones that you can find very rarely in the nether. And that's it. That's that's it for chocobos. It's, it's literally these guys. And we can prove it by going up to Pickle's place uh, and looking at their chocobo farm. And you'll notice that they have only gotten yellow chocobos from breeding. But I think if we do this real quick. I need 12, 13 of these. So there's 14 total members, I'm pretty sure. Oh my goodness, my whole inventory just got destroyed just now. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and attempt to visit everyone's base and give them a little gift uh, from the little newspaper. But if you pause it and read it, you know it's pretty hilarious. So if we wander up here, I believe, uh, Pickle and Animus are working on this together. Look at this. They totally, they totally ripped off my house idea. It's got the same roof. It's got the same, well, it's, it's not marble, is it? No, it's something else. Whatever that is. Oh, that's a cool gate. I like that. Um, look, they even stole my, stole my floor mat. <sighs> thieves is what they are. But you know what I do with thieves? I give them gifts. <laughs> uh, so we're going to go ahead. And I'm going to leave two mailboxes here, one and two, and you'll notice when you click on them, it's going to say the name of whoever placed them, and you can change the name of the box, but you can't change the name of the owner, so yeah, they'll have to just collect these, but I'm going to go ahead and leave 
a newspaper, one in each of these, one for Animus, one for Pickle, and now I'm gonna go through and try to find everyone else. Kyle's will be easy. Let's get Kyle's. All right, Kyle, you can't miss it. Take your free newspaper. And then up on the hill, I believe we have Master Swirl, our Aussie friend. So let's go ahead and drop him off some mail. What's the sign say? Are you gonna confirm it? Uh, Aussie land. Yeah, close enough. Yeah, okay, okay. Let's uh, right next, right next to his bed. You can't, you can't miss it. Perfect, beautiful capers. Check and check. Pretty sure this is Tink's place. I found his bird, so it's got to be Tink's place. Here we go. I think this is Lelith's place. I'm not a hundred percent on all these, but I'm pretty sure on all these. Look, look, Lelith found a green pig. Weird. Okay, anyway, check and check. I hope this is right, Foxy. But here's for Foxy. <laughs> the chest uh, next to the campfire opposite the portal were the instructions I was given. So <laughs> there we go. All right, as for everyone else, I basically got the old, hey, we don't have a house yet. We're homeless people with no money to our name. And so... You can't deliver it to us because we don't exist. So, <laughs> I'm just gonna leave. Uh, can I? Yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna leave them like this. Like like for example, we got Rin. Uh, I, I, I'm not gonna say that for me. And then we got uh, who else do we got? I have I have a list off to the side. Here we go. I got I have a list off to the side. We got Bunny. Okay, cool, cool, cool. We also have. Uh, He's not gonna get this confused. Everyone knows who Daddy is. <laughs> At least a little something for Daddy. Uh, then we have Mila, and we have, last but not least, Twig. Beautiful. There we go. Everything's delivered. And why do we got an extra one? Because of course I I want these for myself too. I'm gonna I'm gonna hang these up. I think these are gonna be really cool. So I'm just you know I'm just gonna hold on to this. It's gonna be awesome. Now let's go work on our little farm because. This bear is constantly starving, and the only way we're gonna fix that <laughs> is if I plant some food and actually, you know, play the Pam's Harvest Craft part. I brought your housewoman gift. There you go. <laughs> well, ain't he adorable? <laughs> it's like the one wild cow still left at spawn. Look, he wants to live with you. Get in the hole. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor thing. Now you're trapped. No, oh, what a shame! Hey, you got a diamond upgrade on your backpack. Oh yeah, yeah. I gotta go. I gotta go oh, big. I gotta. I gotta get all the stuff. <laughs> all the all the things. All the things. I'm loving your house, by the way. It looks great. Oh, thank you. It's super cute. Have you been inside of it yet? It's, no, I have not. It's very quaint. It yes, was you... not here yesterday when I was on. I'll tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at this! Look at this fancy staircase you got here. Look at that. Uh, no, that that took a little ingenuity. I'm just happy you can walk up it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, didn't even have to jump. Oh yeah, look at this. The sofa. This is cozy. Oh, you've got the, the cooking stuff as well already. This is great. Oh, yeah. This is the part that took the most time. Is this. <laughs> the kitchen. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's all the clay that you have to get. <laughs> the, the, the floor was a nightmare. The appliances oh, were yeah. a nightmare. The, the kitchen was the so bad do you, part. Uh, do you know what the floor does? No. What does the floor do? The floor, the floor, the floor, <laughs> the floor, the, the floor serves a purpose. So like, for example, if you had some of this cooking stuff like over here, not like touching the rest of it, it would still access the inventory as long what? as it was on the same floor. Yeah, it's so cool. <laughs> I did not know that. That's really awesome. Yeah. So you can like cook all the Pam's Harvest Craft stuff, like just literally in this. Oh yeah. Look, there's so many recipes. I can just like pull from your cupboards. Oh yeah, that that may have been the most annoying one because <laughs> it required all the other stuff everything else did, but also two diamonds. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. I've not had luck. I I can hear a wandering trader at your door. He's selling a sombrero. Is he? A sombrero. It's twenty emeralds. Amazing. I, I only have nine. I, I think. don't have that many emeralds. <laughs> <laughs> a sombrero, that's amazing. What else? Dang, that'd be really cool to have. No, I'm liking this. I like the mixture. Oh, look, I got your, uh, I got your first edition of the, uh, <laughs> the Peaceful Times. <laughs> that, that, that was my test one, and I liked it so much. I'm like, you know, that's just gonna be the first one. <laughs> I'm like, I just need to see if I can make it in, in Paint.net, and sure enough, I could. <laughs> 
amazing. <laughs> oh, look, there's another cool staircase here. This is like being in a tiny house. I love it. This is so good. I, I tried to go for cozy cottage. Yeah. So yeah, like this is my little bedroom Whoa. loft area. And then up here, I figure it would just be like extra storage. Maybe just, you know, cobwebs and stuff or just de decoration because my real storage is in the basement. <laughs> yes, <laughs> that is where mine will be. <laughs> Cavers! Cavers! Winter, I've achieved sombrero! <laughs> I realize I spent all my emeralds already. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Lilith came in clutch. She bought me. She bought me. She bought it for oh, me. It's me so good. It's so good. It's ridiculously it so big. Good. I love it. <laughs> all right, hold on. We, I got to sleep and get a picture of you. <laughs> this is for the paper. He's wandering off. <laughs> oh, staying true to his namesake. All right, ready? Ready? Smile for the camera. Uh, look up just a little bit. Can't see your eyeballs. There you go. And oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> That'll be in the next paper. <laughs> amazing, amazing. That's such a great picture. <laughs> I'm gonna. It's, 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 it's. I might title it something like, "Fashion Barista Shows Up to Sell Burritos." Oh, we'll see. <laughs> fantastic, fantastic. I, I went into your forest and picked a whole bunch of berries while I was waiting for you. <laughs> oh, okay. okay. Lala, you can't hear me, but thank you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Here, let me get you a waste stone. I don't have anything properly set up just yet, but I got a waste stone. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I've activated the spawn waste stone. So. <laughs> uh, let's see. Where we we'll go? Winter's abode. It's down uh, here. Where's the, where's the basement? In the where's secret the corner. Oh, here. <laughs> here it is. <laughs> the secret abode. Ah. Yeah. Oh, no, like nothing fancy. There. Just just storage. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I love how huge it is. It's like a wall of chests. I'm like, if I, do, if I do one wall of chests, we'll be, you know, it, that'll probably do the job. And then the rest I can do <laughs> other stuff. What's for breakfast, Winter? Uh, breakfast table. Uh, right now, it's uh, a healthy serving of starvation. <laughs> Not for me, I've been in your woods. I have many a food now. <laughs> and a sombrero. <laughs> I have bread. That's it. I got bread. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've got to go show Foxy my sombrero. <laughs> She's going to love it. <laughs> Alright, catch you later, Winter. All right, I've got to like, do some like. I'm gonna do some like moderating stuff, so <laughs> see you later. Oh, yeah, yeah. I've got to go be, gotta go be an admin. Important, important stuff, things. Yeah. So, such, important things. Such wow. <laughs> Such a many importance. Wow. <laughs> Upload mod pack. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> All right. See you later. All right. Bye. Whoops. Mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. <laughs> uh, the house with the green pig. That's daddy's place. Uh, not Lelith's. And I don't know why, but I already knew where Lelith lived. I, I knew this already. See, now this is Lelith's place. And I knew that. I... <laughs> I have no idea why I screwed that up so badly. So, let's get over here. Let's drop off a mailbox and deliver the mail. Check and check. Perfect. And can we just take a moment to just appreciate how beautiful this place is? This is an awesome starter base. Very cute. I really like the ruined style of it. Super cute. I didn't know we had any other fantastic builders on the server. <laughs> I, I, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Or am I? And seeing as this is a special occasion special monumentous achievement we say we're just gonna hang it up right here our first ever newspaper created here on the server ah it's so good i'm so excited for it i cannot wait to write the next one i'm hoping hoping to cause a little a little chaos stir up just a little bit of mischief here on the server uh, and I think that's gonna be really awesome. So, there's a couple of things that I want to tackle. Uh, some of it's gonna be off camera. I do not believe I'm going to be using the replay mod for the rest of this series. It just, it was very difficult to make work, uh, and was really finicky. I, I had several crashes, uh, just in the attempt to get this, that short little time lapse thing at the start of today's video. So. Uh, we're gonna try to tackle this perhaps the old-fashioned way uh, where I just you know I get materials by hand and we do a little bit of it on camera where we talk about it you know like I want to fill in a lot of this water uh, and make it uh, primarily farmland for us to work with 
But there's other things that I want to do around here as well. I need to get our villagers set up so I can get better tools. Uh, and ideally I would do that before I do this. Because obviously I want to I want to take some of this down, but you know, I'm just wasting diamonds if this isn't enchanted or if I don't have a way to uh, repair it or you know, I don't got my brewing. Like, I got nothing. I got lots of tedious little things that need to be done. So we have a couple of options. We can either go small right now, right? Just do something in the back, um, like a, just for a farm, or uh, we can shift gears and do something um, in the vein of, of getting some getting some some stuff together, some gear collected, some work done, so I can do this sort of work. <laughs> oh, I haven't made up my mind yet, so I guess you're gonna find out right now. Yes, I went into the nether, and we found some really good stuff, you know, don't get me wrong. We found a nether fortress very, very quickly. Uh, we found some diamonds in it, it was okay, I mean, it, I mean, it could have been better. No farmer's hat, but we did get the thing that we were looking for, first and foremost, and that is the red vines, the crimson vines, because they turn into blaze rods. And you know what we do with blaze rods? Villager work. We, we can make make potions of weakness villager work so let's let's go take a look all right the, the the nether can be a little boring at times so I decided to mostly just skip it for you and I've been doing the work uh, for my tools this is all in an effort to get tools so I can make the farm uh, more efficiently uh, effectively I don't want to keep burning through dozens and dozens of diamonds breaking tools when I can get efficiency uh, mending that sort of thing so Got these all set up. I've been breeding villagers for hours. Uh, I've been uh, recycling some of these guys so that their trades are nice and cheap. And it's been going very smoothly. Uh, I also, because of uh, this guy right here, the cleric, I was able to get some ender pearls. And because of the blaze rods from the vines, I was able to make eyes of ender and find a stronghold, which I did not film. You know, it's just a stronghold. But mainly I just went there for the books. But I think that's going to just about do it for today's episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Next episode, next episode is going to be an exciting one because this whole place is going to get a nice terraform job. And it's, we're going to turn it into a beautiful farm, a large farm, basically as wide and as round as, 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 as all of the, uh, um, the, the, the sad lands are, uh, except for... We're probably going to stop somewhere at, at, along that coast because then we're, we're getting close to Kafer's place. And I don't want to encroach too much over there. But yeah, there's going to be a lot of... We're going to have a really big farm area. It's going to be very cool. So again, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to leave a like if you like. Subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you guys in the next one.